a highway coach arrived with a seemingly simple complaint. The AC cuts off randomly after 20 to 30 minutes of operation. No noise, no leaks, no fault codes stored in the HVAC controller, just an intermittent shutdown under load. The kind of fault that wastes hours when the real cause hides outside the primary system. Initial checks covered the usual suspects, refrigerant charge, compressor clutch operation, pressure transducers, blower performance, and condenser fans, all tested within specification. Yet during the test drive, the AC dropped out again. System readings plummeted, then normalized seconds later. Inconsistent, hard to replicate, exactly the kind of fault technicians dislike. Attention shifted from the HVAC components to the power supply feeding the system. Voltage was monitored during operation, and eventually, a momentary dip was captured. Brief, but severe enough to trigger compressor protection logic. Tracing the supply circuit revealed the real culprit, a partially damaged ignition relay feeding the HVAC control unit. Internally carbonized contacts were causing intermittent voltage loss whenever vibration increased at cruising speed. Not an HVAC component, not a refrigerant issue, not a controller failure, just one relay outside the system forcing the entire AC module to shut itself down for safety. The relay was replaced with a new OEM unit. Harness connectors were cleaned. Terminals were tightened. A secondary voltage drop test confirmed stable power supply under vibration. Intermittent faults are rarely found where the symptoms first appear. A system can fail because of a component upstream, downstream, or completely outside its functional boundary. Effective troubleshooting is not guessing, it is methodical elimination, circuit integrity verification, and respect for the fundamentals of power and grounding. One relay, one weak contact, a complete HVAC shutdown.